because doing, if you had to go through civil service, and once you go through civil service, let's say, for instance, there was an opening for two police officers. And let's say that we had 25 people put the application in. Mm -hmm. Out of the 25 people, let's say two of them was minorities. Their chance for the two out of 25 getting to be interviewed was just like one in a minute. And so that was a legit, legitimate way I felt, even as a commissioner, that would eliminate uh, our, our minority police officers. Next week, there's another problem. Many of our police officers can't be black white. Most of us got records. Mm -hmm. Every time the police stop you or something, drugs, alcohol, domestic violence, all this stuff. Your name is being put on a record. And every time you apply for a job, what happens, Mr. Smith? You denied. You denied because they're going to go to your record and show you've been arrested for this, you've been arrested for that, and people are not going to hire you. We want to stop that, don't we? Yes. Yes. Yes, we do. You, we want to stop that. We don't want them to use that as why you can't get a job. Right. And two-thirds of our blacks, or minority, whatever you want to call them, can't get a job, they got records. Right. They got records, and they got the record, and it's on there for you. You caused it. That's a question. Well, some people, some jobs don't like to, um, they don't like to give some like to give people a chance when they get a chance and stuff. Mm -hmm. So that's what I'm going to I'm going to tell you one thing. When we get through with our program here, I'm going to give you all some incentives that I don't care. When you, Mr. Uh, Hicks is going to help me. We're going to help you develop a resume. <laughs> Ain't that right, Mr. Hicks? Rick, Hicks, or whatever you want. We're going to develop a resume. On that resume, there are three things that I bet you nobody never put on no resume. And I got it. I'm going to share it with you. I'm going to share it. And, and more than nine out of ten, you'll be hired for those few things that you're going to put on that resume. It ain't about your experience and all this and that. It's about you. Come on, girl. Oh, well, my uh, question to the black, some people in here really don't get jobs because sometimes they could be either deaf or got a problem. That's why most people don't hire people now because I know that was the problem with my mother and my father. Right. So, no, they got a problem. Because my, both of my parents are deaf, and most, deaf, my mother yeah. can't get a uh, job because she. Well, that's what you call that? Discrimination, <laughs> don't you? Yeah. Isn't that right, sis? Her mother's deaf, can't get a job because she's deaf. That's discrimination. Yes, it is. There ought to be something she can do. She got eyes. But you go through the Disability Act. Huh? There's a, a lot of disabilities. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I'm happy. I'm not going to hire this people because they don't need to be responsible. Yes, it's a family law. It's a family law, that's right. It is, but a lot of people don't want to hire disabled people because they don't want to be responsible. Mm -hmm. Well, we got a lot to go, ain't we? Mm -hmm. 